Hey everyone, one of these questions that I get from parents and other colleagues and friends is that their kids are getting close to graduating from high school and the big topic of their minds is uh, college and paying for college. And a lot of kids are thinking, is college right? Is it right for me? Should I go to college? Well, I have some opinions on what I think about college and whether or not you should even go to college or your kids should go to college. Just listen up and uh, here's some tips from Alvin. To go to college or not to go to college? That's a big question. But nowadays, the big topic is, is debt. So many kids nowadays have are dealing with huge debts. Some of the case of 100, 150,000, depending on the college they go to. And that's a real serious problem. And I'm glad lots of politicians are now talking about it and how they can deal with it. And then on the same side, we've got the banks and the other folks that want to continue and to take advantage of our kids and so forth, and uh, that's a big problem as well. We've got a lot of kids graduating right now that are paying $1,000, $1,500 a month uh, to pay back their loans, and that's money that's not going into the economy. That's money that's not going into their 401k plan. Uh, they're not able to buy a car. Sometimes they have to move in back with uh, mom and dad, and uh, they can't live out on their own. So it's becoming a real serious problem for our, our, the United States economy. So people are now asking, is college even worth it? So I, I believe it is. Um, I went. I was blessed to go to UCLA and graduated uh, with a degree in UCLA. I had a great time. Now, the difference between back then in 1991 when I graduated but now is that most people, by the time they're 40 years of age, they're probably going to have about five different jobs. And they're probably not going to have that same job that's related to what their degree was in. And some, some people say, well, why should I even go to college uh, if I'm going to get a degree and I'm probably going to end up with a job that has nothing to do with what I graduated in. I believe that college serves another purpose. There's a lot of different thoughts about it. And some people believe it's about academic um, enrichment and knowing your your field of study that may be the case for a master's degree or a, a upper level graduate degree but not necessarily undergraduate where I think I fall into the belief that undergraduate degree is really good to prepare the student for what we call a bureaucracy of life in this world especially in the United States we have to deal with a lot of stuff. We've got to deal with forms. We've got to deal with applications, checking accounts, pay our bills on time. We've got to register our passports. We've got to register our, our driver's license cards. All of that stuff is bureaucracy. When we have kids, we've got to get their birth certificates. We've got to get their, their medical records going, their vaccinations. All of that stuff is a crazy experience that some people have to go to and that's where I think that if if you don't go to college doesn't mean that you don't get that skill but I think the students that do go they have to get their classes they've got to balance their schedules they got to pay their tuition on time they've got to deal with the whole lot so that's preparing them for a great life ahead in addition to the academics and a lot of other stuff so I believe that college is really important for everybody however it's not for everyone some people are, are going to benefit because they by not going to college because now they get to jump right into the career. Nowadays with the economy shifting dramatically, there are some people that don't need to go to college. They're, they're taking advantage of this new economy where they can create businesses uh, on the internet, uh, but it takes a special kind of person to do that. And some people don't have that skill and you need to gain some other skills. But one of the key things about college is there's a big cost involved. So my son, he's 17, he's going to become a senior next year. So that's a big thing that's on my mind. What was very telling was about a month ago, he was very concerned about college and the cost of college because he's now getting all these letters from different universities and he's starting to see their prices. And some of these colleges are about 40, 50,000 a year. And uh, he's trying to do his best to get keep his grades up so he can apply for scholarships and so forth. But he's already thinking about taking out loans. And what was very revealing and kind of sad and depressing was the stress that he was going through. Um, and my wife and I, we're not rich, but we're not, you know, we're, we're, we do decent. And I think we can help our, our son 
a little bit, but the stress that he's going through just opened my eyes of the stress of so many other kids are going through right now. And I just wish that uh, as a country and the leadership in our and the congressional leadership as well can start really seriously looking at this because it doesn't serve us well when our kids are going through so much stress before they go, uh, graduate from high school and while they're in college and dealing with it afterwards. So definitely I'd like to see more progress there and if there's anything we can do as, a, as citizens, as voters to make sure that um, we can help our kids progress and make sure they're not stressing out as much, that would be really good. At the end of the day, if your child can go to a community college or a, a local Cal State LA or an Ivy League college, Whichever they'd like to do, I still think it serves a good purpose because it gives them skills that they're going to need in their life. Those are the kind of skills that you don't get anywhere. You have to go through it. And in some cases, I like to say, you don't go through it, you grow through it. So if you grow through college, your children are going to have a lifelong experiences and skills that they're going to get that uh, we won't see until later on in life, and they will start to discover that they've got some pretty good uh, life skills that uh, you can't get anywhere else. Anyhow, so I just want to share that with you, that uh, college is important. Is it necessary? Not always, but I think if your kids do have the opportunity to go to college, or if you're thinking about going to college, do it, even if it's at a different level, because those are the kind of skills, again, that you're going to grow into and become a better person. Thanks for listening, and hope to talk to you soon. Bye-bye.